Morning guys, just down here at Swansea and I've got some mullet fillets and garfish from last time we are out and we're just going to go for a drift with them. It's incoming tide at the moment so we'll just drift out towards the drop over the deeper water and we'll see what's going on out there and on the outgoing tide we might try and pick up a few flatties and that. It's really nice today, day today for a change. It's absolutely beautiful. I've got the lines already in it behind me. I've got a garfish on and a strip on. So yeah, we'll see how we go. Hopefully I flash back soon with a good sized fish. All right. Just spotted some garfish out here. So I'm gonna try and catch a couple for fresh baits. I've only got frozen bait, so I would like a couple of live ones for, for good bait. Let's see how we go here. Got one. Yeah, nice one. Good size one. Hard to hold on to the garries, but hopefully, yep, beauty. Absolutely beautiful specimen. Look at that. Perfect. Uh, I think we'll get him live. We'll get him in there live. I'll just keep him, I'll just try and get a couple while I can. Yeah, I'll just try and get a couple while I can. They can disappear just as quick as they can appear. So we want to make the most of them while they're there. You want to make the most of it while they're there. Another one, a good school out here at the moment. Oh, I just dropped him. Yeah, you got a really good school out here on the chomp too. Good to see him on the bite. Usually when they're on the bite, they're quite easy to catch. There's another one. They're quite easy to hook, but landing them, that's the other hard bit. You gotta land them. Yeah, another beauty. Perfect, look at them. Absolute perfect they are. And I'm just using a tiny long shank, a weighted float so I get distance cast. And these are easy, one after another. Beautiful ladies. And I'm gonna chuck one out. This one's straight on live, I think. Yeah, right, swap that dead bait and get this one on live. There's not much as liking that dead bait at the moment. Bloody big garfish. Big garfish. Another one. They seem to love that little wind in. They grab it while I'm winding it in. The easy fishing for these garfish at the moment. Really easy fishing. 
Yeah, nice. Just gonna go for a quick run outside, guys. I got a couple of um, garfish in there, a couple of live garries, and I got mullet fillets, and we'll just see what's out there. We'll have a quick fish till the tide decides to start going out. Hopefully we nail a couple of snapper or something out there, be good. See how we go. A few dolphins over there. I never know if it's a good sign fishing when I see dolphins. They seem to scare the fish off a lot, a lot of the time. Yeah, big bloody school of dolphins here. <laughs> there must be about 20 of them. Hopefully they stay over that way, because they will spook all the fish away. They come over here, and they are heading this way, of course. Heading straight for the boat. Oh, no, they're turning now, actually. Big school. Fish won't be liking the sight of them too much. Well, that proved the theory wrong. <laughs> Just filming the dolphins and hooked one. Feels a bit coddy actually. Bit of a dead weight. Yeah, it feels a bit coddy or something like that. Yeah, big, big bloody red rock on. These are good eating if you can be bothered cleaning them. Yeah, they're really nice eating, but I can't be bothered cleaning them. You gotta be very careful of the spikes because yeah, you'll be feeling it. If they get ya, you, you'll be fe feeling it for a, a while after. too well. Tell me it's another cod or something. That's a flathead. We're on the flathead ground, blue spot. If I can get a couple of them for a feed, I'll be happy. Very happy if I can get a couple of them. Feel slightly bigger. Uh, it's a flat head, but it's not much bigger. Need to get into those bigger sizes. Something I don't want here. Dead weight. I guarantee you I don't want it. It doesn't even have a kick at all, so it really got me thinking what it is. A eel maybe. Oh, bloody shovel nose. Not even a kick from it. Not even a kick. Even give me a kick, it was weird. That's it, guys. What a shit fishing trip! That is the worst fishing trip I have had in about a year. I didn't even do a sign off, I wasn't gonna do a video, but I figured I may as well put something out, and at least you guys get to see not every time you do smash it. So, yeah. 
I'll probably get out midweek or something. I got a big Lake Mac fishing comp this year, um, this weekend actually. So serious fishing this weekend should be a good video actually. And I may get out midweek because yeah, I really want to get decent fish. Anyway, guys, if you ain't fishing, you're wishing. And I'll see you on the water. Catches.